Hey everybody, it's PTC Pet, and today, not with a happy message, but I have something I really want to show you guys. Everybody must make their own opinion, but I am leaving UFF and I'm going to show you guys the reason why. I've been fighting with my team, with some of my team for some days now, which I'm going to show you in multiple tours as I'm going to show everything and make your own decision. I just cannot put my name on this company. And it really hurts my soul because it was my baby and I wanted to make sure that everybody got saved from it. But I'm going to take you on a tour now. I've been getting messages from Wasim Aka, like, hey, this person is selling 4,500 UFF in 13 hours. Each hour, he's dropping the price really hard. I don't want to ask in the group. I don't want to fight. Where did he get that 4,500 UFF from? So I asked them, is this our address? Because I didn't know anything. Is this our address? And then we're going to go to the next slide. Because I was a little bit in panic, I was starting to talk Dutch in my uh, in my English group. So I was, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know that I, I was talking Dutch. I say here, maybe we need to slow down a bit with selling before we get accused of soft rugging. It's our minting wallet. I think I report it. Maybe it's better to wait a bit for now. As when you look at the wallet, I can understand people saying this is a software. It's a random message, but I see it as a warning. If he notices and takes it wrong, other people can and will do it also. On to the next slide. I would gladly delay some of my earnings until we are bigger to ensure that there will not be a panic in the project as we are in the early stages and trust is the most important thing, especially in the moment. This address who sent who sent him to sell is the first address, is our main main, yeah, how you say it, or uh, yeah, main main address of the UFF main address is the tax address. Yeah, that's how you say it. I'm gonna go to the next one. And I'm, I'm getting, I'm, I'm a little bit concerned. So I'm telling the people, then I'll get back. Yeah, that's our address, but how else do we handle it? Every farm does the same. Some will notice, and I already said to somebody else, we are the ones doing that. How are we going to pay ourselves and marketing? This, uh, they understood, as I mentioned, that this is done in such a way to minimize price in fluctuations. Soft rock is something else that is taking out liquidity in larger, larger, larger chunks. I'm sorry, but this is just business. We need to get paid to. What really hurts me is I've put my name on it. I've said, guys, we're going to do it like this. We're going to do it like this. We're going to grow together. We are here long term. And then that in the first couple of days, besides every, every yield farming, uh, everybody, everybody was already doing because we were in pre-sale already earning. Even besides that, we, we're going to pay out like uh, 70,000, 65,000 for for what or yeah for what for just the first five days because we own we own the company it's not how it's supposed to be i'm going to go continue and i'm going to show you why i'm so ashamed and hurt a soft rug is something else that's taking out liquidity in large chunks so i can totally understand we need to be paid and i definitely support that but i'm just saying that we might not need to be paid six thousand plus a week especially as we are just starting and then I get back the answer, why not? We earned it. We worked our asses off. And I make the people understand. So I'm trying to explain myself. It might be better to first, first build up the users, liquidity, marketing, TVL, make sure that it doesn't affect the price so much. As I believe everybody would like a good bonus. But it might be better to pay out smaller amounts of, of salary in the beginning, especially as we are growing so rapidly. Not saying anything bad about us getting a big paycheck, but I do think that it can create fun if they check and the team is paying out 50K every week as the project is still in their baby shoes. And then I get back an answer. Yeah, we will always have this issue. I got, my, you got money, bro. Some of us are in huge debts and this is their way out. We have earned it and only one complained about it. Well, I was definitely complaining about it from the start. Then I get back. And then uh, I get somebody else said, well, if I'm going to get the paycheck tomorrow and then you must think, guys, we already got paid over 6,500 BUSD. So that was dumped on the price times seven a person. And a day after we're getting $2,500. A day after we're getting $2,500. I do not accept that. And I'm also saying that if I'm getting the paycheck tomorrow, I'll buy a stake in UFF and then I get an answer, uh, somebody else get an answer from, yes, that's perfect, but some of us need to pay the bills. And of course, other people also talk in the chat. I understand that bills come first indeed. And then I say, well, 
I can totally understand that, man. That's why I'm looking for a way to make it happen without problems. I'm not saying people must not get paid. I'm just looking for a way to mask it. People will check the wallet for sales and this is it's the tech, test wallet. And that one has many transactions, I believe. And my point is that I, I'm continuously saying, let's delay it. Let's not pay out so much, but I getting attacked like, yeah, I got money and this and that. So I was also a little bit hurt. And I say, well, like I can say for me in the future, can send me to a wallet I'm farming with. Then if, if we sell something, people can see that it's from the wallet we also bought massively and harvest massively with. And I'm, I was I was fighting for many days in my group, and that's why I was I was also offline. I was so confused and hurt by yeah trust issues because it was just in my name, and I've built this, and I've it, yeah it's really, just really really shit. I'm so I'm saying in my group because people forget I'm doing this on a professional level. I am paying my bills from it. I am constantly bringing in loads of new investors, and I am mentoring many into becoming financially free. There were agreements on advertising budget. And I thought as me being the only one who's doing this professional, we brought in a lot of people. And as one of the owners who's risking his reputation, which he has built over four years, I would have had more saying in how and what would be working. As I've been saying in the beginning, what is needed, what we would be needing to do. And I do not want to sound cocky, but I am doing this full time and for many years already. I have found out what works and what does not work by spending loads of funds and money over the years. I pushed in over 20,000 as my reputation and my dream is behind it. I had proof it was working and everything was skyrocketing. Skyrocketing. Was waiting for the support as I was paying everything. And then I get the message that I'm spending too much for something that might or might not work. I was constantly showing many buys, a big reach on many crypto sites and even a growing TVL with our team selling and many others also. I dropped my advertising and the price drops heavily. I stopped at 3.65 and we can see it in the charts. TVL went through half in no time. The charts look red as almost no new people coming in and panic is starting. And I can say that even when crypto going down, the chart shows red or green with buys or sells. If not one of the two happens, it stays around with the same price range. And uh, it continues. This is going to be after a couple of pictures and then I'm gonna to go to the second presentation. I was a little bit, this is like, I'm saying what is happening? How does this make me feel? What is, yeah, I was, I was fighting so hard to try and save this. I was a little bit hurt emotionally by how it went as I thought it was not really fair and been thinking some days, shall I say something or not? As the last time I tried to say this calmly and believe me, I only say this with the right intentions. It might be better to first build up the users, liquidity, marketing, TVL to make sure that it doesn't affect us so much. I believe all would like a good bonus, but it might be better to pay out smaller amounts of salary in the beginning, especially as we are growing so rapidly. I'm not saying anything bad of us getting a big paycheck, but I do think that it can create fat if the team, if the team is paying out 50K every week as the project is still in their baby shoes. I got an answer that it was easy for me to say as I already got money, which also hurted me because all I do is with the best intentions. I will earn anyway, but this project is my mission to help hundreds of thousands of people out of poverty. And my inner circle, you guys are lucky seven, is to make you rich. And wait one second to the next slide. People are forgetting I'm coming from poverty and the homeless shelter. I was sleeping under a bridge some years ago and have built up everything up with nothing. I know how it works to build up a successful business with crypto and to keep it profitable. I have many proof online for multiple years and multiple projects. That would not have happened if I did not know how to manage funds or send funds in advertising instead of paying myself out too much. I know what it is to be hungry and also how to spend your funds so growth will not occur. As I have seen many people around me hit a success and be in debt without a year again. I do believe some things will have to change as I so carefully was say, trying to say some time before. And I first want to say, this is not an attack against nobody or meant in a negative way. I just want this to succeed. And I would love to see us a whole lot more effective instead of the way it's going. Then I say, we all have our strong points. Our team is diversified. I believe that I should have more saying in how the marketing should go as I'm showing it is my strong point. Just like I do not say coding should be done this or that way as I do not have experience in that. 
and it's going to be a uh, yeah i need i have four more slides then uh, this one uh, this film is finished and then i'm going to show you uh, another one this is going to be uh, an explanation of why i'm going to leave leave uh, yeah why i'm leaving uff as i'm 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 so tired from fighting and trying trying to save my name trying to save the project and i just get ignored and i got yeah offended i'm going to show uh, one the, the yeah the i'm just going to finish so I get uh, yeah, you could talk to me. This is an attack against me, and I answer, this was not against you, my man. This was for the whole team. We make decisions together, and all must know what is going on. Transparency to the team, as I've been open from the start. What I spent, where I spent, what I do, and what I would like to see happen, as what I believe is needed for a successful project. The last time I was answering in the team meeting, what I want, what is my vision, what is needed to succeed. And everybody had their own vision and what was new, what was needed, and how to do professional marketing. A couple of days, I pulled back, saying, "Okay, show me how to do it. If maybe I can learn from you, or I've checked new ways. I just see our project getting hurt, and many investors come from me and now say, "Well, you guys not posting marketing anymore. Ah, Gri took over. No more updates on marketing. And when mentioning it, the last time there were many other things noted, which should be started by multiple from the team." So that is why my message is against everybody. I am doing this full time and professional. If there is anybody with working ways to advertise or bring hundreds or thousands of investors in, I am definitely open to talk about it. As I'm not perfect, there are many ways I do not know about and other people might know. I'm just, I'm trying really hard. And uh, I get hurt like uh, this is our first agreement as a team and uh, we, can, uh, we can speak on it. I say, uh, Oh yeah, I was I was hearing that I was not being honest to my community and this and that, and I was not supposed to report this outside. If I was going to to uh, yeah to show this outside to outside, I was not being honest to my community. And you see this? I've been feeling myself shit from the first moment I carefully said we are soft rugging. I constantly be ignored and such. And all who I brought in gets dumped on dumped on with over one hundred thousand dollars by the team. That is not honest. And I get, we are not soft rocking, bro. Jesus, we are paying ourselves from our emission rate. And then I say, more honest than the message I just put out, I cannot be. And then, of course, I, I see soft rocking is bringing the, the price back to 25 cents. I carefully made sure it didn't affect the price. Soft rock is dumping the price. And I say, soft rocking is dumping the price on the community. And that is what is happening. Last two pictures, guys. We did it. Let's go on Discord now. And then, I, then I'm saying, I have built years. I've worked years for building a reputation. And I am not going to let it be destroyed by greed and somebody on a power trip. I get that it's not true. Except, and this was the first time I reported it. We dropped our price by 25%, even with buys. It might be better to first build up the users, liquidity, marketing, and that whole riddle I was just saying. And this is the last picture I'm going to show. And this is this one really captures my emotion. And uh, I'm, I'm talking about carefully, that I was constantly reporting carefully what is needed and how we should proceed. Instead of just being ignored, I even get stepped on and attacked on my honesty. The way I advertise is not working. I stopped four days ago with advertising. What's happening with the price? I kindly and calmly say in a respected way, this is how I feel. This is how it appears to me. I believe that this is not the way to go, and I am dishonest. My marketing is proven not to work. I say, well, it sounds like there's almost nothing anymore to talk about. Did somebody else of the team say, bro, we're going to talk about this, and then, I'm gonna, and then I say this. I'm going to say one thing. I am extremely pissed, and I feel disrespected. I feel betrayed and ignored, and for days, I feel like my community is getting soft worked on. If I get any more disrespect or be called not honest, I am finished with it. Time to be fucking respectful and kind instead of feeling like a fucking god and above others. This is part one of uh, yeah why I leave um, why I leave UFF and it really hurts my soul. Honest, honesty is key and I cannot uh, no I cannot accept this. So yeah, this uh, it's really uh, it's really hurting. You can see the, the picture behind me. Honesty and loyalty are key. If two people can be honest with each other about everything, that's probably the biggest key to success. And uh, yeah, it lacks honesty, it lacks transparency, and I cannot put my name on this. This is part one of why I leave. 
the next part is going to be exposed 